The renovation of Nova Scotia's iconic Blue Nose 2 is veering off course tonight. Plans are two years behind schedule, and the project is millions of dollars over budget. This week, a test drive of the world-famous fishing schooner was called off. And as Ross Lord reports, the delays are taking a toll on local tourism. Lately, the sense of pride surrounding the Blue Nose 2 has been replaced by a sinking feeling. A Canadian icon and major tourist attraction is drowning in debt and delays. I feel like people would come and they wanted to go on the Blue Nose, see the Blue Nose, and that brought a lot of people in. But now the past few summers that she hasn't been able to go out for sales to the public and whatnot, that she maybe has lost a bit of interest. There were more concerns after it was discovered the rebuilt schooner's wheel was almost impossible to turn. Then came a test drive planned for this week. One of the main reasons for doing the pre-sea trial was to do some further assessment around the rudder and the steering system because there had been considerable um, concern expressed around um, the functionality of that system. So we wanted to take her out there to do some testing. But even that went wrong when the government discovered at the last minute a certificate from Transport Canada was needed. We were told verbally that it was okay to move her, and so we did think that that was what we needed to do that. The setbacks are testing the patience of seasoned mariners. Former sea captain Lou Boudreau was a deckhand on the wooden schooner as a teenager. For me, uh, you know, the blue nose, the stuff of dreams, for sure. Now it's a financial and planning nightmare. I feel so sad for it because it's almost like an orphan. Nobody wants it. We need to go through it from... A to B, top to bottom. Nova Scotia's Premier, who has already ordered the Auditor General to review the renovation, is now shuffling the bureaucrats in charge. Listen, I'm as disappointed as every Nova Scotian that this has continued to, to go on. Uh, it's why we've taken the action we've had. As the damage control accelerates, the Blue Nose 2 remains tied up. It's anyone's guess when it will sail again. Ross Lohr, Global News, Halifax.